sparkle shine when I hit the street them is mine I mean we be looking so fine when we get to the club we don't wait in line we just walk right in me and my friends the way the lights hit we be sparkling we smarter than your average check my average known for being lavish but being a savage on huh? check for me I'm a this is the kind of occasion we all relish as football fans. Non-stop hype all week long. And now for the action. Hello everyone, the weather forecasters promised us a very pleasant day for football and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box as always by Lee Dixon. And it's all about action from MLS. It's Real Salt Lake. And they take on the San Jose Earthquakes. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players how important it is to get off to a quick start here. Attack the game from the off, impose your game plan, and hopefully we get a good game. Well, for the San Jose Earthquakes, they had a difficult match to contemplate last time and ended up drawing in the game against the Seattle Sounders. How do you see it going, Lee? Well, a very tight game, 1-1 in the end. Not a bad result, but I've got a feeling they'll do a lot better today. I'm going to predict a win. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Fierro. Oswaldo Alanis. Ewell. Jutson. And they could really get at the opposition. Can they get in behind them? Perfect challenge. Rossi. Couldn't keep the ball. They've regained possession. Albert Rusnak. Judson. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. This looks threatening, and a goal! Now they have their opener, and now they can celebrate! Wow, what technique, when the ball comes to you and you don't need a touch and you can just whack it first time like this, what a goal! Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? One nil then. Goal for San Jose Earthquakes. Number 14, Jackson Ewell. Valery Kaisaishvili. Jimenez. He's in behind. Well, here's the replay, and it's a lovely through ball to set up the chance. And he had choices of what type of finish to apply. And bang, he goes for the smash. Lovely goal. Second goal for them here. San Jose Earthquakes goal. Number 14, Jackson Yule. Good looking sequence. Plenty of options. Wanted to keep it but couldn't.
Judson. They've won back possession. Ramirez. He's given us away. And a throw in it's going to be. Well, that's gone out and it is going to be a goal kick. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. He's asking plenty of questions of the defenders, Lee. Well, shot after shot, he's sent goal bound, as we can see. Keeper must be really sick and tired of him. Keeps picking the ball out of the net as well. Albert Rusnak. Corey Baird. Portillo. Rossi. Dangerous looking attack. It's a perfect challenge. There will be one minute added on at the end. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. And so it is, the first half story has been written. Well, this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Lee. Wow, he's simply the difference between these two sides. All the eyes will be on him for this second half. Can he get the hat-trick? Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Ewell, Judson, Jungwirth, Jimenez, Ewell, oh and a perfect ball now, how about this, and taken away. Baird. A reminder, you can join us for MLS action on EA TV. It's Real Salt Lake facing the Los Angeles Galaxy. Yeah, I'm predicting a cracker there. Both teams will have a real going. Oh, surely! A goal! That's exactly what they needed. That should get them believing again. Well, here's the replay. It's a really dangerous ball into the penalty area. And from there, the soft cushion volley is an absolute dream. I love this goal. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. Well, two one it is here. Real Salt Lake goal. Number 11, Albert Rusnak. Jimenez. Well, that's one for them to pursue. Running with the ball confidently. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. An inability to keep hold of the ball there. What can he do from here? Oh, that's a fine pass. Fine cross into the middle. Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. Ramirez. Congratulations to today's lucky fans. And just looking ahead to MLS action on EA TV live. It's the San Jose Earthquakes versus the Montreal Impact. Well, that should be a really interesting matchup atmosphere. I'm sure we're going to get an absolute bell to Derek. Well, they're eyeing that final pass, you just feel. Take it away. And giving the ball away. But attacking possibilities. And he's beaten him here. Well, that's the kind of play you want from your defender. The visitors are struggling with possession, really. But again, we've seen it before. We'll see it again. 
Their counter-attack play has been absolutely fantastic. Pace really hurts defences and they've got that in abundance. Well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. And well, there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. Real danger. And successfully cut out. 15 minutes remaining. Jimenez. Good looking cross. Well, the keeper certainly didn't want to gamble with that. And a corner it'll be. This is the kind of occasion we all relish as football fans. Non-stop hype all week long. And now for the action. Hi everyone, it is an absolutely splendid day for football and we're looking forward to the game. My name is Derek Ray and with me in the commentary position is the Arsenal legend Lee Dixon. And it's all about action from MLS. It's the Montreal Impact and they take on the San Jose Earthquakes. Yeah, thanks Derek. Both teams will no doubt be looking for a quick start. So important to get focus from the off. Really looking forward to this. Hopefully it won't disappoint. And the lineup for the home side. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4 2 3 1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4 5 1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. Thank you for joining us. And introducing the visitors' lineup today. An element of caution about this selection. Yeah, 4 5 1, Derek. The five players behind the lone striker will need to support him. Looks very strong midfield offensively and also defensively. The back four will be protected throughout the game. Well, sloppy in possession. Jutso. Ewell and he's won the ball well no let up plenty of pressure and winning it back great strong tackle throw in forthcoming Well, for the San Jose Earthquakes, parity prevailed in the last game. A draw against Real Salt Lake. Lee, how do you see this one going? Well, a decent away draw last time out, 2-2. But I think it'll be different today. I think they'll win the game. And couldn't keep himself onside. to get tighter here well, it was a menacing attack but tidied up so a throw in here and the cross is very much on an attack full of promise 
Can he get them in front? Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Jimenez. A really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. It might be on for them. And a throw in forthcoming. Quick of thought on the defensive front, Wanyama. Raitala. Still passing it around with authority. Wanyama couldn't keep it. Kazajvili. Espinosa with it and intercepted it. And there to intervene. And continues his run. An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. Now the delivery, and nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Good strength to keep the ball. Wanyama. Napalainen. Wanyama has it. Wanyama. Can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Well, he's done really well with his angles there. Good reactions, too. Played into the centre of the box. It's indicated there will be a minimum of one minute of added time. That is that for the first half here. It was one of the better players in the first half, but needed to be better still. Lee, your thoughts? Well, no goals for him, no real chances either. He needs to help his team a little bit more just to get involved in the game. I think he would be the difference if he was playing better. So the game has been restarted, the second half is underway. Well, we have to have a better second half. That first half was pretty dull, wasn't it? Both sets of players need to shake themselves out of this malaise that they're in at the moment. I'm sure the managers have had a word at half-time. Couldn't keep it. Wanyama. Breaking at pace. showing good patience forced into the penalty area making sure nothing untoward happened well this is the home of live football and we have more action from Major League Soccer coming up on EA TV it's the Montreal Impact against the Seattle Sounders yeah game after game the season is relentless but players just love to play give them a game any day of the week that should be a belter attention J Diaz and that puts him in position promising attack but his timing was off so deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture
couldn't hang on to it. Oh, lovely ball. He's using his strength to good effect. Chance to play it in. Not the pass he had in mind. Well, he'll be thanking his lucky stars that the referee settled for a verbal warning rather than a booking. That's a useful cross. And after the cross, defensive action called for. Well, this is the home of live football, and we have more MLS action coming your way. It's the San Jose Earthquakes facing Atlanta United. Yeah, really looking forward to it. Always a great atmosphere in that stadium. It should be a really entertaining match. Raitala. Well, it's come down to the final 20 minutes here. And still dangerous. Safir tied air. Still passing it around with authority. Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. Raitala. Read it well. And intercepted it. They're on the scent of a winner late in this game. They're not cherishing the ball the way they usually do. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Can they keep it going? And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Espinosa. Inside the final two minutes of this contest. Jutson. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. There will be one minute added on at the end. And there goes the final whistle. This game is over. Goalless, but by no means eventlessly. Yeah, probably not the best game I've ever seen, Derek. I don't think either team really played to their full potential. The final ball was often lacking, and a few clear chances they did create, they just weren't able to take advantage of. Bit disappointing, really. I did expect more. Our camera lens trained on one man. What a fabulous start to the season for him. Does he have more goals in his future? Stay with us. Hi everyone, it is an absolutely splendid day for football and we're looking forward to the game. I'm Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary position as always by Lee Dixon. And it's all about action from MLS. It's the San Jose Earthquakes, and they take on Atlanta United. Well, I'm excited about this one. Great atmosphere in here. Everybody looking forward to this game, especially me and you.
Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. Lee, what are you expecting from him? Well, whenever he plays, you should expect goals. He rarely disappoints. I don't think he'll disappoint today either. The goal scoring record looks shaky to me. And the lineup for the home side. Fairly conventional 4 5 1 setup. Yeah, that back four will be protected throughout the game with the five midfield players in front of them. Really important that they do support that lone striker when they do have the ball. Well, here's the Atlanta United starting 11. And this is a formation most people in the game are very familiar with nowadays. Yeah, most coaches are adopting this formation. What it does give you is two holding players in front of the back four to protect them. But it also gives you three supporting players to that central striker. Jimenez. Good pressure high up the pitch. So it's going to be a goal kick here. Well, he's going to be disappointed with that pass. They've won back possession. Over the touchline for a throw-in. Possession lost, intercepted. Well, for the San Jose Earthquakes, parity prevailed in the last game. A draw against the Montreal Impact. How do you think this one will play itself out, Lee? And he's in. And a goal! Not wasting much time today. They strike first. Well, let's take a look at this replay. The difference between a good player and some of the best players is they don't need to take a touch. Gets his shot away, first time. Nothing else matters but concentrating on that ball. The opening goal of the game then. Thompson. Kazajvili. Judson. Valery Kaisajvili. And it's a quality pass. And he's gone into an illegal position, unfortunately. Jutso. Jimenez. Well, pass after pass. Maybe they can chisel an opportunity. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. And looking towards the back post. What a lovely strike! Lethal piece of finishing. Drilled home with true conviction. Tremendous goal! Well, we can see it again here. What a lovely inviting cross into the danger area that was. And bang, he doesn't need a second invitation. Beautiful strike to finish. Even Steven won a piece on this match. Eric Remedy. Moreno. Attention, Jennifer Burnham. Please report to guest relations for an And a throw in forthcoming. Jennifer Burnham to guest relations, please. Thank you. Jimenez. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass.
Chance to play it in. Young Viet. Oh, nice ball over the top. Went in strongly to win the ball. Still passing it around with authority. Played in there. Could be. Oh, my goodness. He's caught that so well. A goal of the highest class. Fantastic technique. Well, here's the replay. It's a really dangerous ball into the penalty area. And it's a dream of a finish. Pure quality. It's the hardest technique to get right for me. It's all about the timing. Well, 2-1 it is here. Espinosa. The hosts have really controlled possession. However, after that, the coach will be disappointed with what they produced. They need to be a little bit more clinical in front of goal. Judson. Moreno and he read it well intercepting it so the half-time whistle and the hosts have their work cut out for them in the second half their tremendous home record under threat here Lee plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins Ewell and a poor ball Eric Remedi Franco Escobar and Mesa on the ball already closing him down here possession given away unfortunately well, a quick reminder, there's another MLS game for you to look forward to on EA TV. It's the San Jose Earthquakes facing the Los Angeles Galaxy. Yeah, really looking forward to it. Always a great atmosphere in that stadium. It should be a really entertaining match. Well, there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. Delightful pass. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Corner kick awarded. And let's see if this will help them add to their lead. Here it is now, a substitution. Well, the header, but a comfortable save for the goalkeeper. Yeah, he has to do better than that. I could have saved that, Derek. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Jukson. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. This could be the equaliser. And it is the equaliser. Well, now, that could be a huge turning point in this game. They carry the momentum. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Yes, a show of emotion, and why not? They're back in this game on. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle.
Moreno. Remedi. Franco Escobar. Moreno. Not a particularly strong challenge. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Jimenez. Well, just as well from the defensive point of view that he was able to make that interception. Martinez. And the ball's gone. Inside the last quarter of an hour. Martinez keeping possession of the ball with authority. Now, let's see what they can do here. Oh, just mistimed his run and the flag going up. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And they'll get ready for the throw-in.